Make your own wand. You'll need a one foot long, four inch wooden dowel, any size wooden star, hot glue, regular glue, any color glitter, any color paint, and ribbon. Take your dowel and take your star and place it exactly where you'd think you'd want it to go. Obviously at the end is a good choice. Then using a bit of hot glue, try not to glob it on like I do. It'll take a bit because the hot glue is going to be hot for a while. Um, so you'll have to hold it and kind of smush it with your fingers, but once it's cool it should stay in place pretty well. Once you're sure it's secure, take your glue, I use E6000, but any kind will work, and put it on your star. Liberally is fine, or you can do all kinds of designs on it. You probably know how to use glitter, we've all done it when we're five, so just do whatever you want with the star as far as designs or a full cover glitter, that's what I do. But as you can see, I take my E6000, because that's some pretty hardcore glue, and it's all I have, and I put it everywhere and then I spread it with my finger. Once your star is all shiny with glue, take your glitter and apply it. You can dump it on, I suggest dumping it over a piece of paper so that you don't waste any glitter or you don't have it all over your floor. Um, and if you've done designs, just shake off the excess and then put some more glitter on, more glue and glitter. Then take your paint. I'm lazy, so I actually just dipped the wand into the paint bottle. Uh, but I suggest maybe putting it on like a normal person. But anyway, after I did that, I spread it out with my finger because I hate paint brushes. So pretty much everything on moonprism.com is finger painted because I'm five. Once you've got your paint on and it's dried, it'll probably take about 24 hours just to be on the safe side. You use a little bit of glue, hot glue, underneath your star and kind of twirl your ribbon around. Once you have your ribbon spiraled around the rod, take another piece of ribbon and tie it in a knot so that you kind of have like a lace, shoelace effect. Um, it's just like two pieces of ribbon hanging down under the star. And then after that, take another one and tie a bow. So then you'll have a bow and four ribbons hanging down. It's really cute. And voila! You have a super cute magic wand fit for, I guess, a queen? A fairy queen? I don't know. But either way, it's really cute and would be fun for a little girl, a grown woman. It doesn't matter. Enjoy!